Okay, Tower Boots actually updated, so you know you're going to have to come out of retirement for this one. Okay, let's get a load of going, bro. Do I still have- oh, I still have my stuff. Yo, let's go. Okay. I haven't made a Tower Boots video in forever, but just because it hasn't been an update, so, like, I actually have- Oh, I think make a video. Oh, bro, that already Oh, you know what? I should play with some randoms today. Why not? Let's, uh, let's get the queue going here. Make this guy start his party. You know what? I'm going to create a party. Alright. Let's go. Boom. Boom. Two Degrassi. What's the best map? Sky Islands. I haven't played this until it was a trick or treat modifier. We're gonna run. We're gonna run this. Public on. Cool. I don't know if this is a good loadout. Someone will have to correct me. Is there any new skins? I don't think so. No. Damn, that sucks. That's what it would be. Yo. Join my party. Let's play. Yo, German. Okay, let's get some people in here. Yo, can people join? Hello? Am I this forgotten? I remember there was a time, a point in time where I used to like have people join my party every millisecond. Yeah. Is this guy doing it? Oh my god, fuck no. Hell no. I am not doing that. What a thunderclip. Actually, no, I want an easy map. I want to actually beat this. Let's get some people in here. This guy's the exact same loadout as me, so that means I'm going to assume my loadout's good. 3 of 8, let's go. 3 of 2 of 6, shit. I gotta pick my Discord server for this one, don't I? Oh, shit, yo. I actually don't think we can get a. We gotta get a match in time, dude. Shit, 4 of 6. Okay, it might be doable. Okay, let me uh, pull up my Roblox profile. I'll just ping my Discord server. Profile. Shit. I <laughs> need. Okay, copy link. Watch it like be at 6069. Oh, fuck. Is it like a good party? Yo, why am I lagging? I don't think that's good. Yeah, there's like noobs in here. I don't know who's in here, bro. We're, you know what? We're rolling it. We'll ping the Discord server next game if we need to. What is happening with my- Yo, where'd my mouse go? What the fuck? Okay. Let's go, boys. I haven't played this game in forever. Why are we only have four people? Okay, let's do expert, I guess. Is that six? One, two, three. Yeah, it is. Perfect. I am farming. My frame's good. 66? No, they're not. It's fine. We'll turn them- no, let's go. Is that- Is that better? Yeah, it is. Cool. Shit, bro. So this game's like super... I didn't even think they would update it, but this is so cool. I'm so glad they did. So who's... What's the defense looking like here? I don't see any towers. So what does the Halloween thing do? Does it just add pumpkins? Oh. Does that have new sound effects? I think it does. Okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. You know what? That, that's kind of cool. Am I missing? Any Is that actually it? it will, I don't have. I'm not in the Discord server. I can't check update logs or anything. Shit, bro. Um, I'll go to Twitter. Well, I wait for my friend to update, uh, upgrade. Give me a second. Twitter. Tower. Blitz. Tower Blitz Wiki. Oh, that's the wiki. I'm dumb. Tower Blitz News. Yep, I trust these guys. Oh, yeah. Right here. All enemies have a pumpkin. Oh, so what's it? You get John work currency if you beat the halloween modifier apparently has future use cool okay so we're gonna get john pork money man this game this game fell off oh this fits tough by the way yeah i've been playing a lot of well not tablets like I, I i actually it's not probably dislike tablets i 
I don't know. I don't know what that means. Let me just let's mention it. Um, it's not that I don't like it. It's just like it's been. There hasn't been like a single, a single update. What was the last update, dude? Actually, like I feel like it's been a long time. Give me a second. It's been a long time. I'm gonna scroll down for a moment. The last on June second was the last update, so it's been a long time since this game got an update. So I'm glad that they actually did. Apparently, so we're gonna get the John Fork money. I wonder if they're like it'll make the boss harder or something at the end. Well, it probably will. It sounds like something they would do. Like maybe like actually, I want to see what Overlord does like with the fucking pumpkin. Because that actually sounds funny. So. So, I feel like I've missed a lot in the tower defense community. Like, I think TDS has fucking weekly updates now, which, like, that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> that game never had updates, like, let alone weekly updates. So, that's actually really cool. Um, apparently there's, like, a new tower of sorts. But, I'm not... I'm not sure. I think it was like a first person shooter tower because I was talking to... Shit, can I upgrade this to a 3-0 yet? No. Okay. I was talking to... Let me pull up the TDS. Oh yeah, I got unbanned in the TDS Discord server, by the way. Finally. Um, pull up the Tower Defense Simulator Discord server. I was talking to what's his name, dude. I forget his name already. I'm so fucking dumb. Was it, it was either out of dinos or that other... Um, Dev dude, what's his name? Dude, I don't know anybody. It was either Dinos or Cap, 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 or yeah, I was talking to one of those two. And like, there's apparently a big DJ rework and like a first person shooter tower, which I'm assuming is just kind of like Gatling Gun from BTD6, but that's kind of cool. I'm glad that they're actually expanding. I was trying to play that game was with Biffy when the consumables update came out. So we'll let they're actually expanding and doing a lot of updates. I think the game's been... Well, I'm gonna assume it's been more alive. Um... Has it really? See, I feel like I should just leave this video on end and just have, like, a talk show during it, but I don't know. Let's see. Tower Defense Simulator. Yeah! 9k active at 11... Uh, no, sorry. 10.30 at night. That's actually pretty good. So, congrats to them. Um, I know that Melius got hired there, and I know that Kepara did. I don't know Tyler did because I know Tyler. He's a cool dude. Yo, we're gonna. Oh, no, 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 his Adel. Uh, so, proud of Tyler Festival. I feel like Tower Blitz, I probably. I got pinged to this update. I didn't even know this game update. Apparently, the update wasn't. Like, was. I think it was a bit ago, wasn't it? Or was it today? Because I got pinged about it today. Like, I was in the shower. Yeah, it was the 12th. It was like two days ago. But. Um, I got pinged about it in the discord server just like today in the tds discord server i was like i didn't even know that game i know there was like a tower blitz 2 or something like that happening but like i feel like it's kind of a waste to do tower blitz like i could but like i feel like it's just not worth it at this point like let me know if you guys want me to do tower blitz like, i will like i i genuinely enjoy it i just don't know if it was worth it so but if you guys like it, I'll gladly go back to doing them. If you guys can just give me some ideas. So, let me know what your thoughts are on that. Um, I'm debating whether I just want to upload this as raw footage. Or not. Maybe I'll pull my Discord. Make sure you guys join the Discord server. Because I actually, if if I do do tablet videos again, I want them to be more community involved. Like, you guys kind of decide what you want to see in a video. Decide the topic. Maybe we'll do some community gameplay footage. I think that would be fun again. Because we did that what when winter first came out we did that yeah yeah we did and that was super cool do i have attic commands again no i had hope okay <laughs> um we did that when the winter event first came out and that was like super fun so i actually would be down to doing that again if you guys want to join the discord server i'll leave a permanent link in the description of this video i feel like this video is not going to do well just because i haven't done a video on it in so long and i'm probably out of the tower let's algorithm I feel like I haven't seen any Tireplus videos on my homepage in, like, months. I think I saw a new Joiner video, like, in 1944. <laughs> Fucking ages ago. 
but I don't know. I feel like I, I, I don't know why I was actually like people liked my content when I was like doing a lot of it, and I think it was because I was unfiltered, and I still kind of am. Like when it comes to YouTube, like you know, I don't care. What I say that. I don't think I've edited anything I've said bad out of a video, like you know, which. And I also don't use a script. It's pretty obvious I don't use a script. Like, I just kind of, you know, I talk my shit. <laughs> Whatever is on my mind, I'll just say it while I'm recording. And I kind of like that. And I feel like it was, I feel like some people kind of like that sort of approach of, like, you know, on the fly. If I'm wrong, like, please do correct me on that. I, I have no idea what the fuck is. But it was kind of fun when, you know, we had the gang and I. Like, remember we had... A pretty cool uh, group that we used to record with. We had Raz, Rascal, not Raz Tex. I haven't talked to Raz Tex in forever since that dude retired. But we had Razical, we had Chris Arrived, we had Biffy, and that was a. We had Justin, yeah. That was a fun gang, I'm not gonna lie to you. We had some fun times recording some, like. We have some unreleased videos. I probably have launched them at some point, but I have to edit them. But we had some fun times there, and I kind of do miss that part of being a content creator. So that was kind of cool. Um, I think Justian's actually got his own channel going now. I think it's actually doing well. I haven't talked to him in a while. I don't. Um, I do think his channel. Let me check. Sorry about the tabbing out. When I tab out, it like swaps the window a little bit. <laughs> um, let's check. Just Ian. Let's see. Yes, he does have a Discord server here. Oh, yeah, he has been doing decently, actually. Let me just quickly pull up his channel. I'll, I want to see what he's doing. Because I know that he really wanted to do YouTube stuff. He has 212 subscribers. That's not terrible, actually. Nice. Okay, good good, good stuff, Ian. How do you do? So, he's been doing pretty well. Good for him, good for him. Um, Chris Arrived is still an official TBS content creator and stuff, so I know he's been doing decent. Uh, me and him actually work on a game that, again, is unreleased. I'm really, I'm like the king of unreleased projects, dude. So, yeah, I know he's been doing good. And same for Razzle, we also work on an unreleased project. But yeah, it's, I kind of stepped away from YouTube when the game stopped updating. Not even stopped updating, when there was, like, I didn't mind being creative. But eventually, like, you know, you hit a dead end when the game is a give, like, that's one of the things with Tire Blitz, is I noticed that it's, it's good, because you can do a lot of content, there's a lot of challenges and stuff you could do, but once you're, once you're done that, like, you know, what else are you going to do? Like, creativity has a limit when it comes to games that don't like update for it like i felt like if even tower Blitz had even released one more not even major update i'm talking like even just like five or six more skins i probably could have made six or seven more videos on it before like you know even just small stuff like that if you're a game but it'll keep your content creators going which actually helps you in the long run but this is just gonna be a lot of raw footage of me talking so I'm actually gonna ping my Discord server about this now. Again, if you don't know, I'm gonna be saying a lot of repetitive shit, so if you want me to stop, like, please. <laughs> oh, this keyboard's so loud. Are we gonna die? I should probably check that. I should probably be helping my team. Are we good? Yo, yo, yo. Yo, I hit spawn. Where are my dudes at? Oh shit, there we go. Let's go. We're chilling, bro. I'm the goat. I'm gonna get a 3 0 light beam right here. Nah, 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 we're good. 3 2, actually. Ooh, look at that. I'm getting fancy up here. Uh, let's get some more markets down. I'm like not, I'm like half focused. Uh. Okay, look at that. I actually 
hold my Discord server. I don't do that very often. A, B, and C. Cool. I'll just put that in anything. Um, I know Tower Battles. Tower Battles is the only game I've actually been playing Tower Defense like recently. Uh, my 1v1 win streak is like 148 now. I beat people like Wild Phoenix, um, Clicker, and Planet Earth himself on that run. So if you guys want to 1v1, let me know. Like I'm, I'm the goat now. Trust. Um. That game has not even received a removal of the Halloween 2023 event, so you know, plan is just gonna slap 2024 on it, like just change the 3 to a 4, call it an update, and you know what, you know what, mad respect to you, Planet. you know, you just kept it long enough that you could call it a new event. No, he should have like one new enemy, so you can technically call it new. That actually sounds like something he would do, that's the funny part. But, has there any, I don't think there's been any current new like tower defense games like i know there was like fucking skibbity toilet dumbass dog shit defense game there was tdx which i made a video when i first came out but like personally i don't like the red as a person that's just my view and it it kind of turned me off in this game so i didn't really play it that much but i've heard it's decent there's critical tower defense which i've played it a few times that was actually really good i first i actually really enjoyed it at first there's SCP Tower Defense, which is made by my friend Mashi. I haven't actually played that yet, which is kind of funny. Probably should do that. <laughs> um, but I've heard that game did really well for a little bit. But, like, I've been so disillusioned like, how little I have life. I know it's crazy to think a tower that's YouTuber has a life. This is unheard of. However, I do. And yeah, I haven't really heard much about games that much. I've had people ask like, "Whoa, well, you should you should make a Tower Bus video again." And I'm like, "If you want to give me an idea, I'll gladly make a Tower Bus video." And then they just don't give me an idea. So, <laughs> like, you know, you know what I'm saying? I just heard bruh and it caught me the fuck off guard and then realized Bobo Market has the dumbass bruh sound effect. I don't know if I'll do raw footage. How long is this right now? I apologize when I tell about it does that. It's so dumb. Oh, uh, it's 18 minutes. Okay, that's not that bad. I was hoping it wouldn't be like, I was hoping it was like, not like 40 minutes. So, yeah, in terms of me, yep, time to steal the spot. It's all about me now. Mwahaha. Um, I have a new house. Like a new job. Uh, I go to university now. Crazy to think that that sinks in too. I never realized that. Holy. That sink in from. That's crazy, dude. Um. Fuck. Oh, Biffy moved all the way across the country. So. Yeah. He's fucking at University of Toronto now. So that's. That's insane to me. Um. Yeah, but there's been a lot of changes. Um, I think if there's anything else that's like worth noting, like besides just not being around, um, I'm gonna look through my announcements in my Discord server because I post stuff there sometimes. Let's let, let's look. Oh, I saw my cousin for the first time in like four years this year, which she's in China, so that was that was pretty special. So that was pretty cool. Oh, uh, let's. Let's look around. Hmm. Did we lose? No. I, I thought I heard the death sound. Okay. I was to say, the only reason I have this much raw footage is I'm trying to fucking win so I can get the stupid cash thing. Whatever it's called. John Pork Money, dumbass. <laughs> Such a dumb feature, bro. I love it, though. Oh, I'm looking around. Oh, yeah, I have grad. Uh, I have some pictures of that. In my personal life discord server which like no actually it, it's pretty it's pretty cool uh, if you want to go check that out and yeah that's about it i've been watching a lot of hockey again but let's be real that doesn't that doesn't surprise me um 
Shit, yeah, that's about as far as it goes back. I haven't been online as much as I used to be. Which, that's a, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Don't worry, don't worry. I've been hitting the gym a lot more and stuff. Which I very, very much needed, I think, at least for me. Okay, dude, an awkward silence. I don't know what to say. Like, I should have written a script if I knew it was gonna be this long, dude. Oh my god. Oh, let's see. I kind of blew a bunch of Robux. Like, I don't really. Like, I kind of gave it all away. Like, um, I don't know if you saw the was like two weeks ago where I gave like thirty people core blocks and I gave like ten people on this this week because yeah. I should do a headless game on my best blocks. Actually, you know what? I will do that if this video reaches a thousand views, which it probably won't. But if it does, like, invite people to the Discord server, if we can hit 500 members again, even just level 1 boost, yeah, we have, like, no fucking boost, bro. Um, I will... I'll do a Hubble skip more. So, I'll do three, actually. I'll do, like, three Hubble skips. Those, you know, why not? Um... I think... Like, I feel like... Do, would you guys... Would you watch Power Defense in other content? Like... I know I did TDS videos. I think my, my most watched was a TDS video, but like 99% of my views is um, probably terrible. I think it's more than that. I will check that. You know what? I, we're gonna run it. Um, I'm gonna check that, give me a second. Okay, how am I still getting 2,000 views a month? That's insane, man. Let's check content. Analyze. Cool, let's check. I have 211,000 views on Tower Defense Simulator, and I have like 700,000 views on my channel. So you guys do the math there, it's like... Yeah, wait, let's do it, let's do it, hold up. Five over seven. I, I'm so bad at math, dude. I should know. This is that's like what seventy one percent. No rounding. Probably like seventy two. So seventy two percent of this channel's like views has come from Power Blitz. But that's crazy to think about. That's like five hundred thousand views on a single game. And I know there's some people who have like way more than that. And shoot, like props to them. Because I've seen some Tower Blitz content, even recently, like, two, three, four months ago, that was actually super high quality. Like, for instance, new joiners, his stuff was always fire, dude. I was kind of that guy that you could, like, it wasn't good quality videos, but it was videos. So, uh, yeah. Um, I'm trying to think, like, oh, we have Boltmaster? I forgot about that, dude. I gotta get a super cool thumbnail shot for the, of a, of a, what's it called, dude? The stupid dude with the, the overseer dude with the pumpkin, dude, I can't talk, it's so late. I didn't think I'd be recording a video today at all. Oh, he dead. Like, I feel like this isn't even an update video at this point. It's more just a catch-up video. But I would love to do more videos soon. I think it'd be kind of cool. Ooh! Dude, like, I got a new chair recently. And, like, oh my god, my back doesn't hurt as much. So... I feel like I've been super lazy when it comes to action. Oh, let's see what the... God, this person is really... 
Oh, you guys just want the raw footage. Just straight up all raw footage. Oh, shit. Man. There's so much awkward time. I have to put background music in now. Okay, you know what? That's good, though. It's easier to edit. I don't have to cut anything. I can just, like, copy, paste. Nice. So, I'm gonna... My fans don't even have to be on. What am I talking about? Um, I still have the same computer that I used to edit all the videos. I actually still have every single tire blitz, tire of a single video, and unreleased video on this computer still. Which, that's, I can tell you the exact amount of storage that takes up. Give me one moment. Uh, hedge your mental guesses real quick. I'm gonna check. 734 videos, 1.09 terabytes. Because <laughs> I just never deleted them, and this thing has like, fucking... 18 trillion million billion gigabytes of storage, so I don't really care about it. Um, if you guys want me to release the unreleased videos, like, I, I'd i be glad to. The issue is, like, the footage is so outdated, dude. Like, I have some footage, like, before the Christmas event came out, and that event's been in the game over a year. So, the footage I have is so old, I feel like, like it would be so bad to watch. Because it was also, bef like, some of it was before I got this computer, when I had my old computer, which had even worse specs. So the recording is ass on it. I actually have both of my new computer right now, so wish me luck. I mean, clearly tell them things off quite a bit. Um, I wonder, like, I feel like my frames generally slightly feel better, considering a lot of my higher graphics quality than I usually record on. So I feel like that improved, so good for them. Respect to people who fix that. I feel like. How do I feel this? I feel like Tower Blitz is really nice to that. If they would put- they, they have the money for it, they have the people for it, if they actually did stuff with this game, it, it could return to what it was. Because this game, when I was, like, actually popular making videos on it, had what? I want- how many? Like, 4,000. 3,000 active. Which, now they're lucky if they get 100, so it's like 30 times the activity just because they released one event. Like, that, that's crazy. And I'm assuming, even if you didn't even want to pay people that much, you could definitely find people who would be willing to make the maps and skins. Hell, if you even want to add emotes, emotes for free in your Discord server just because they like the game. And I think it kind of sucks that they're so focused on just getting the bag from Evade. Because realistically, Evade isn't even that good of a game. It's just a copy of Migos. They're so focused on the money part of getting it from the that they completely neglected the fact that this game still has potential. Like, I know there's Tower Loops 2 or whatever, but like, I don't know. I feel like this game could be so much more than it is right now. Even while waiting for Tower Loops 2, it is not that difficult if they wanted to take some time out of their day and go through some community created creations, like maybe some skins, some maps. You don't want to go that far. Add emotes versus there's definitely people who be willing to make them for free. And it would improve the gameplay experience, improve your activity, content creation, everything so much. And then you're still getting, if clearly all I care about is money, you're still getting income. The more players, the better. Hell, you could even add community made challenges. That actually would be really hard to make. But you could add a challenge submission. People submit challenges had them in a pre-made format and just put them in the game. Like, realistically, that stuff, you could even just do, like, maybe t five skins, five maps, five emotes, five challenges a month. And that would still be enough to satisfy a lot of players. Because the thing with skins is they aren't cheap. If you get a really high-quality skin, it's like 30 points. And 30 points is a lot of time. So you're gonna get playtime with that. Playtime is premium payouts, and people will spend money and build up the game, which equals more revenue for you. I don't see the appeal in not taking the time to do small things like that. Because I know Tower Blitz, like again, Tower Blitz 2, it makes sense to me, but will I probably play Tower Blitz 2? No. Realistically, no. Because there's something about the original power. It's just like this game has a charm to it. In a way that not a lot of other games, Tower Defense games especially, do. Like this was originally made as a passion project and it just shows in like the creativity of everything, the extensive lore. Like everything about this game 
shows that it was like it, it was a passion project that turned out really well and really high quality and i don't get why they wouldn't want to you know like at least do something for it because this game's player base is devoted like i genuinely mean that i can't tell you how many times when I was uh, in the Discord room, when I had the like, contributed plus or the content creator and all that dumb shit, I would get DMs from people like, hey, could you ask this person when the next update is, hey, could could you make this suggestion? Uh, I made this skin slash map. Can you DM beef up? It's like, this game has such a devoted and caring community for it. Like, also, they waited through so many delays. They waited through eight delays. I remember QA testing the Christmas update before it came out, and they delayed that shit like nine times. And I remember, like, people were mad, obviously. That's always gonna happen in a game. But they didn't complain after it came out. Like, they, they, I, like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, they thought the Discord server, they always do. But nobody complained that, oh, that, you know, this update sucks and it wasn't worth waiting. They were like, Okay, this is a good update. They put their whole bias of this ass, it took 10 years to come out, there was too many delays. They put that behind them, and they were able to acknowledge the update, and they didn't hold a grudge for that. Like, the next time there was an update, it got delayed by like in like 2-3 hours, but nobody complained about it. Whereas, for instance, if you look at games like Power Defense Simulator, even just a 15 minute delay, the whole community goes off in the developers, they're firing the shots, or at least they used to when I was there. And it's like, that's the kind of community that you, you want for a game like this. And it feels like they're just kind of throwing it away. Like, okay, I'm sorry, I have to interrupt my insane speech. Is this a cute one with a pumpkin? Yo! Okay, that's actually kind of tough as hell. I actually really like that. That's so cool. That looks way better than I thought it would. Okay, I actually really like it. It's the longest delay. So it doesn't feel like the performance is that much better, but maybe it is. My computer's just gotten more ass. Can I not? Hello? What? Yo, it just disappeared. Thank you, Rick. I remember I used to make videos with uh, SD on this game, actually. Remember he used to want admin do once they move on commands and all the commands. And SD was super chill. I don't think he works for XO anymore. But I truly think that like he actually like I don't think I wouldn't say that he cared cared about the game that much. But he definitely was good on the community side. Like for instance, he was in our content creator Discord server when that was popular. I remember people would ask him, like, hey, dude, could you, like, do this for me for a video? Because I don't want to spend hours trying to set up this one shot. And he would be like, sure, dude, let me join you, or something like that. And, like, Tower Blitz had a lot of people like that, that, like, you could ask, like, hey, could I spare five minutes of your time hunting with a shot? And people would be willing to do it with no personal gain of it, which... It's one of those things that it's like, I don't know, it's one, it kind of drives me insane because so many developers want that for their game and they would spend hours, hours, months, months, hell, even years trying to get a game that's good, that they enjoy making, and that could have a community like that. And Towerblitz has it, and they abandoned it for a bit. And like, I'm not trying to disobey. I don't think it's as good of a game. I think it has a worse community. I think it's more than the money than the making game that people will actually enjoy. And it's one of those things that you just sit back and you think, like, if they gave this game here to somebody who could actually care for it, could it potentially reach the popularity of Tower Defense Simulator reach? And, I mean... This is all opinion based, but I think it could. I really do think that this game has it has some sort of it has some how do I explain it? It has like its own unique features to it that you don't see in other robust hard defense games, or if you do, you don't see them well. For instance, the lore of this game, dude, I have been playing this game for over a year, almost two years now, and I still don't understand anything. A single fucking thing about it. 
that's how extensive it is. There are some people, I think the lore videos on this game are like two hours long, which props up on some videos who started that. Like that. I actually respect you so much for that. But, like, how, like they put that much work into it, man. And it has the dual pass system, which not a lot of other Roblox hard friends games have. And if they do, it's not done in the same way that Tireballs does it. And it just adds so much room for creativity with, for instance, if you're going to make a strategy. Cool. Maybe you want to optimize strategy. Oh, hey, I'll do 5-2 instead of 2-5. That's cool. There's different ways to farm. There's different ways to do early game, late game. There's just so much you can do. It's like there's more possibilities. Like, whereas Tower Defense Simulator, for instance, to beat Molten Mode, there's one set way that's the quickest. You just place down eight Mac accelerators and wow you won the game in like 10 minutes congratulations here's your fucking cookie whereas this game has like okay I got 10 minutes on hard mode what if instead of doing market and fucking I don't know what other test sniper I did businessman in the game okay what if instead of doing five businessman at 1-0 I did three at 2-0 when I make more money faster and that sort of creativity aspect is what one of the things that made Tower Blood so, like, open. And the reason I was able to make, like, 300 videos on it was because there were so many options. Like, for instance, you could do bottom path only challenges, top path only, 2-2 two, two only. You could do so many things with such a little limited arsenal. And the fact that they didn't widen that arsenal was also one of the reasons why it fell off. Like, this game has, like, 13 towers. But it basically functions as 26, because each path is so different that whenever they add one tower, it's the equivalent of adding two or three. And I really think they could have just even added two more towers in between that long ass break, maybe even three. And that would have changed stuff like the speedrunning community part of the game, the strategy part. E even when the event was out, it would have changed strategy, speedrunning. Everything about the game can shift with a single tower change, which Oh crap, no, not the slowing ass dialogue, no, oh my fucking god, dude, there should be a way to skip this. Um, and that's one of the, like, for instance, if Tower of Bullets adds a new tower, not Tower of Bullets, Tower of Fence Simulator adds a new tower, it's like, okay, this tower, I don't know, I'll use the Gatling gun, I haven't tried it, I don't even know what the fuck it does. You can shoot in first person now. That's cool, I guess, I'm probably still just gonna place 8 max accelerators and win the game. Whereas if they added, I'm trying to think, what would be a cool tower for Tower Blitz? Let's say they added, hmm, what would they add even? Because that would fit with the lore of the game. Um, I don't even know. I'm trying to think. I'm dumb. Uh, let's say they added, maybe a, a, like they have a rocket launcher tower. Maybe they added, oh, we already have a freezer. Maybe they added Pyromancer. Let's say Pyromancer, and it slows down enemies. Okay. That sounds kind of cool, actually, right? It could change the way every single mode speed run and everything is done in so many ways that I don't see, like, you know, why wouldn't you? Okay, he actually does have a giant pumpkin on. That is so fucking cool, bro. Yo. Okay, that's actually kind of fire. It's one of those things that, like, you had, like, you know, you could. You have the time, you have the space to do it, you have the devs that don't want that could do it. You have the money to do it. And it's like you could get so much more out of this game than what it is just by adding, say, one tower. Just by adding one more mode, one event. Hell, even just three or four new skins, one new challenge. Because this community loves tower blitz. The tower blitz community loves their game. And they will find a way to augment that thing. Hell, I remember when I was in the content creator club server, there were people that were like, we should try the fastest way to speed run each challenge. And, oh shit, wait, we have a, oh, we don't have a bugler. Yo, wait, oh, are they doing? Oh, wait, um, yo, are we good, dude? Oh, we do. Cool, this seems goaded, bro. I'm getting carried. And, okay, this is so laggy stuff. Um, it, like, they just need to do, they could do something. And the fact that they don't have them just kind of pissed me off. Even like before I saw them, it, it, it pissed me off watching this game fall apart, fall apart. Like even just three hours after the game, five, and so many different ways. And I think 
I don't know. I, I really think they should give the game to somebody who could even sell it. Hell, I'd buy it for like 10 million Robux. I'm probably more than that. I, I'd pay that for it. That would actually care enough to work on the game. Because this this could be revived into the top five, top three talent of this game within two weeks if they wanted to. And uh, I feel like Beef Chop was an Ultra Dog, but man, they stepped away, this game lost so much. And then when Lord Tactics stepped away, it just died. Anyways, this is just John Court Currency. I have been yapping for about 30 minutes about Tire Bullets, which we haven't done in a super long time. So uh, if you guys want to see more Tyler's videos, please do join my Discord server, talk to me about it, any ideas, DM me. I really appreciate you guys, your time, everything. If you made it this far in the video, um, DM me on Discord if you're in the Discord server, um, the letter C. Then we'll do, no, we'll do Z. DM me the letter Z, and I'll enter you in a giveaway to win Headless Horseman. Thank you very much. Um, hope you have a great night. I'll see you next time I record a video. Hopefully that's soon. It might not be, but you know, never lose hope. We got one John Pork thing. It's kind of dumb, but all right. And, um, you know, good night.